of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. So, um, I guess it's good day to everyone. Uh, I'd like to think that there are also members of uh, the BLD from different countries and uh, uh, chapters attending this novena uh, for our dear Archbishop who passed away two days, I think, two days ago. And uh, of course, uh, we are saddened by his uh, sabihin natin, untimely demise na rin. For although he may have been rather um, sickly and uh, may have had health issues, nevertheless, uh, he passed on because of you know internal uh, internal organ failures brought about siguro by by COVID. So nakakalungkot din naman dahil uh, ngayon na medyo pababa na ng pababa ang mga numbers ng COVID, ayan may pahabol pa. And our dear Archbishop ay isa sa kanila. And uh, nakakalungkot dahil um, siyempre uh, may pinagsamahan din ng BLD uh, for I understand 17 years. Uh, you know, napakabilis ang panahon. Ano? The Archbishop has been the Global Spiritual Director of the Bukas Lobs sa Diyos Community. And it is just uh, siguro naman right and proper na we pay him tribute and we pay our respects for to him who has uh, served the community for uh, 17 years. And... Um, he has been a guiding uh, and steady guide, especially to the different uh, chapters of the BLD. He has gone around in order to animate uh, the different uh, communities and to bring about unity, especially with the, uh, with the center. And ang nakakatuwa, of course, sa kay um, Archbishop uh, uh, Lagdameo, Angel, is, uh, you know, kanyang simplicity, uh, laging nakangiti, uh, and then very calm, ang kanyang composure, and uh, quite cool. Of course, uh, it was also during his uh, watch na medyo naghiwalay ang uh, BLD at ang uh, Serbia, but, you know, somehow nangyari din ng maayos and uh, nagpatuloy pa rin kahit na papano ang lahat peacefully and uh, quite calmly. So uh, he has done a lot for the community and I know that uh, marami talaga ay nalulungkot dahil wala, nawala na siya kasi marami rin ay kanyang na-influence at uh, marami na-inspired sa kanyang mga, sa kanyang leadership, most especially during these last 17 years. Parang napaka, parang kailan lang 17 years na pala. Mukhang mas matagal pa nga ang kanyang pagiging spiritual director ng, uh, ng BLD community than, of course, our father and founder, uh, si, uh, si Father. No? Uh, kaya uh, talagang uh, naano na rin, na-imbibe na rin ang spirit ng BLD sa kanya. And so, uh, nalulungkot tayo, but then it is what it is. Uh, we have heard in the gospel today, uh, do not let your hearts be troubled. Have faith in God and faith also in me because in my father's house, there are many dwelling places. So uh, at least alam natin na siya na naglingkod, uh, hindi lamang sa simbahan, of course. Uh, he has also held leadership uh, positions with the Catholic Bishops Conference of the Philippines naging head din ang in charge ng mga lay people uh, siya ay lalong lalo na naging malapit sa BLT dahil nga siya ay naging steady guide ng community throughout all these 17 years and so uh, uh, we pray that the Lord may reward him sa lahat ng kanyang mga nagawa at lalong lalo na sa kanyang mga kaputihan na na ipa uh, mulat sa mga members of the community globally 
And uh, siya ang naging simbolo, of course, ng pagkakaisa during this last 17 years. We know, of course, in fact, that even though he may have gone ahead of us, nevertheless, uh, at least siya ay tahimik. And uh, alam natin na he has simply passed on. Uh, life and death are intimately intertwined. And so alam din naman natin na uh, whether we like it or not, uh, eventually, uh, inevitably, death is going to strike us home. But at least we know na may naghihintay na gantimpala uh, para kay Archbishop Angel for all the service and the, the dedication that he has uh, done, not only for the church, but more importantly also for the community. And uh, siya na naging kod ng maayos at lalong lalo na naging tapat sa kanyang panunungkulan uh, ay ipinagdarasal natin makatanggap ng buhay na walang hanggan. And so, my dear uh, brothers and sisters, it is good that we are together in prayer. At ito na ang talagang pinakamagandang, you know, magagawa natin under the given circumstances. Na ipagdasal ang ating mahal na si Archbishop Angel Agnameo uh, ngayon na siya ay pumanaw na. And I'm sure na natutuwa naman siya na siya ay naalala ng uh, mataim team ng mga community at ng mga different chapters of the, the BLD community all over the world. And so um, at least let us be consoled by the fact that uh, he is already with the Lord and therefore no greater hand can take care of him than the finger and the hand of God. And praying together for his eternal repose ay certainly isa sa napakagandang pwede natin gawin, uh, lalong-lalo na sa kanyang pagmanaw. At uh, kay Manuari, uh, ang kanyang buhay ay maging ehemplo sa atin, sa katapatan, sa ating Panginoon, sa paglilingkod at sa pagpatuloy na paggawa ng kaputihan, uh, hindi lamang para sa atin, kundi para na rin sa ating mga kapwa. Let us now call upon God, the Almighty.